Hello, my Luna baby, and welcome now to Thursday. Well, cloudy, introverted, feeling really blah and offline today for the Cancers. Your home planet is in Aquarius, so you're deep into trust and intimacy issues. For those of you who are psychic, you might be hearing all the ghosts in the afterworld today. With your home planet, the moon, in Aquarius, you got your ear to the ceiling, basically, but it's your ear is to any boundary anywhere. Now, this makes you very randy if you're in a safe, nice ability to connect to someone on a sexual level. This also makes you feel very vulnerable if you don't feel like your walls are up. Could go either side of the moon. Depends on where you are. But if nothing else, you're probably more guarded and certainly more detached than usual. Zim into the sun. Adding to this, we're in chapter 2 of sun in Capricorn. Neptune is ruling the day. Neptune is this energy energy. Logs us into our higher self. Makes us more intuitive than usual. And today is an excellent day to use that intuition to get to the bottom of this month's topic. You in partnerships. What the hell's not working? That's really the big question to ask if I was a Cancer. What's not working? Why do I keep attracting this pattern? Why is it that guys like this always ask me out, but guys like this never ask me out? Why is it that everything goes fine for the first four months and then sabotages? Ans asking the question why is great on a Neptune day. You will see the patterns. You will see the big pictures. You will get the answers. And if you ask for a symbol from the universe, you will get it. If you ask for a message from the universe, you will get it. And right now, if you have a strong question about a particular relationship, by golly, that person might even text message you or call you and tell you what the answer is. So why ask why? Because Neptune told you to. That's why. And today's a Neptune day. Now, Mars, which is ahead of the sun, is suggesting that you might have to take some activity or action to get to that answer. You might have to reach out. Reach out and touch someone. Remember that campaign from AT&T? I don't know why that flooded through my brain. You get an idea of how Neptune works in my head, pulls back 80s commercials. But Mars is saying you might have to actually reach out or do something or take an action in your relationship. Or you might have an action happen to you, bad news or a certain weird message or anything of that sort of nature. But action will lead to answer as well, says Mars. Mars is saying and encouraging you to go ahead and try things in your relationship. Don't just process and don't just think about it. But again, if you need to get to the answer of why, today is a great day to go ahead and ask that question. And it's Thursday. We've got Siddiqui Salter's Renegade Everyone Therapist going live today. She's going over Clary Sage. You've probably heard about Sage. Sage clears a room of bad spirits and bad energies and all that sort of thing. We'll get to the bottom of how Clary Sage actually works. Try our plant medicinal expert, Siddiqui Salter. She is live talking about Clary Sage, aromatherapy, and also eating and even as a skin, dis uh, a skin ailment, everywhere Soul Garden streams. All right, Cancer, that's all I have for Thursday. Tomorrow, Venus moves into Sagittarius. All those details and more in just 24. Live, love, be. Soul Garden.